Now that we know how to graph inequalities, let's make these questions more interesting. Let's see how we would graph all the values for m that make this statement true. m plus 3 is greater than 10. Well, we begin by solving this the same way we solve an equation. We collect all the constants, all the numbers, together. In this case, we need to remove this 3. And we do that by subtracting a 3 from each side of the inequality. Now this tells us that m is greater than 7. And we remember how to graph this. Draw a number line, an open circle at 7, and shade the number line. How would we solve and graph 4 is greater than or equal to m minus 4? We need to add 4 to both sides, and that tells us that 8 is greater than or equal to m, and we can show these values on a number line. Remember that we can add or subtract values on both sides of an inequality, just like we can with an equation. Let's try one more. Try solving and graphing negative 3 is less than 4 plus b. We would subtract 4 from both sides of the inequality, and we will see that negative 7 is less than b, and the graph of our solution would look just like this. Now it's your turn.